Good morning and welcome back to Life on the Eddie Family Farm. I hope you guys are having an awesome Monday and the kids have went back to school and then I have just been kind of kind of being lazy this morning. I just it's Monday. The kid everybody's gone. Brandon's actually at work. Um and it's beautiful outside. It's not too too windy and it's not too too hot. It's just it's perfect. It's beautiful. The sun's not out. It's cloudy, but it's not rainy. It's not humid. It's perfect. It's a beautiful Monday morning. But we still got to get the chores done. So I already watered some of the chickens and um, some of the other animals, but I wanted to go ahead and I want to get some snacks and get them out to the donkeys and maybe the llamas and I'm going to go scramble up some stuff and see what I can find. But I was sitting up here, I wanted to start up here because the Chicksaw Nation, hopefully, it was supposed to be weather permitting last week and we got too much weather, we got too much rain, storms, just nastiness. But this week's looking a little bit better. It shows north of us is going to be getting some large hail and some um, bad weather, possible tornadoes and stuff like that. But it doesn't look like it's going to reach us. But you never know. Storms shift course all the time. But um, yeah, that's what we're doing up here. Or that's what I'm doing up here. And I'm going to get back down there and go find some feed and some snacks and stuff. But I wanted to kind of show y'all a picture of Layton and Braley. So Layton just finished um, pretty much with band and he plays the clarinet and he did a show um, about maybe a month ago. I'm not for sure, for sure on dates, but, and he did amazing. He did really good. Um, it wasn't a single act or anything. It was with the whole band, but he did really good. I want to show you a picture of that. And then also Braley's T-ball is over now. So baseball for boys and then softball starting for Addison, but, um, T-ball's over and Braley did amazing. She is the fastest kid I know and she just overall an athlete but I wanted to throw up a picture of her she's super excited in this picture and I'll show you all that right here but now we're gonna get back to it and so I'm gonna go down here and I am going to grab some snacks and then meet y'all back out at the mm, the donkey pen. We'll start with the donkeys. I'll see you in a bit. All right, so I got the treats, and all they are is goat treats probiotics. It's the apple flavors. And let me tell you, these ones are the smaller ones because they are for goats, but the horses, the donkeys, all of them seem to like them really well. Um, we had a hard time at the beginning for Juliet and Romeo to actually get um, those kind of a little bit bigger ones in their mouth or I think it was just because they were new and they just their teeth hurt or I don't know but um, we're gonna start with these and see how they like them and then I want to get some more um, actual horse treats and um, other things but for right now we're gonna stick with these so let's get up here and show these donkeys how much we love them. Hey! How are you? How are you guys? Alright, so I'm going to actually come in here. So I'm going to need you guys to back up. Actually, instead of right here, I think they smell it. I'm going to walk down here because I think 
it's a little bit better to open up the pin from this side. So we'll go down here. See if I can do this. All right. Here they come. They're like, she's got something for me. They must smell it. Well, hey, I, you got to let me in here so I can give y'all a snack. Yeah. All right. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pick up a little bit. There, acorn. Hey. Hey, red apple. Look here. Here. Can I reach over? Or y'all want to do it like this? Huh? There you go. What is that? Is that good? Yeah. Red apple's like, I found it on the ground. I'll eat it. Looky there. Woo! <laughs> so I'm trying to do it. These little pieces are a little bit harder to contain than those bigger ones. Hi. Look up here. I don't want you fighting over it. Here. <laughs> I'm scared. You got me scared. There you go. Are those yummy? Beautiful cupcake. You want some or are they going to make it where you can't have any? Huh? How about I put some over here? Look. They didn't even notice that. Beautiful cupcake. Here. Here's this. There you go. Come on. Would you get back? Let her have some. Just hold this. Oh, what about that? Don't make me drop it though. All right. Beautiful cupcake. Hey, girly. Would y'all let her have some? Y'all let her have some. trying beautiful cupcake I am baby y'all are rotten now hey hey no we're not gonna be pushy I won't feed you I won't give you treats if you're gonna be pushy No, you're not getting any. No, sir. No, sir. Nope. I know how you're working that butt. Nope. Now, that's not very nice of you. You know that. I'm going to sneak a handful. Look, I don't have nothing. 
Hey, be nice. I don't have nothing. No, nope, I don't have nothing. What are you doing? Yeah, there, go back over there. Beautiful cupcake. Just wait for her to come this way, I guess. I know it just takes patience and time. He knows I have something. He just knows it. I don't have nothing. Y'all go mind your business. Oh, so close. What do you get spooked for? Do 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 do. Oh, <laughs> y'all right at thing. I'm going to go pour some in this feed bowl where they can actually hear a bunch of it going in there. All right, let's try this again. Beautiful cupcake. Come here. Come here. Uh, she won't come to my hand. Maybe she'll come to this. Beautiful cupcake. Come here. Look here. Okay, so that didn't quite work how I wanted it to. And I could have got inside of there with them, but I'm just, without anybody being here, I'm not comfortable enough to go inside there and actually hand feed them. I, don't, I mean, we have through the fence a lot, but there's, there's just still a little bit of some food aggression, if you can tell. Not like kicking or nothing like that, but kind of dominance. And that's going to, I mean, that's going to happen, but I'm just not all the way there on feeling safe by myself. So we'll go down to the ponies. Hey, ponies. Would y'all like to have a treat? Now, I know the ponies are a little bit more food aggressive. So we will take it slow. Good boy. Oh, I dropped some. Here you go. Good boy. Oh, now. Here's this. Good girl. That's a good girl. Now y'all be nice to each other and I got more. Come here, Romeo. You're way up there. <laughs> Good boy. And you know, I'm okay with dropping these out because the, the goats are still um, out. So they can, they can actually pick up the excess Good job, guys. Here. Here, Twix. Good boy. That's a good boy. Yes, him is. What about you? Think you're apple pie? No, don't you kick. She's real ugly. Yeah. We don't tolerate that now. Here you go. 
I think we named him Hershey. I think Kaysen named him Hershey Chocolate Bar. Romeo. Romeo. Come here. Hey, how are you doing? Here. Mmm, that's good stuff, huh? That's stuff you can actually chew on. Good boy. Y'all are being so good. I need to just carry this bowl over here, but then I have to keep bending down. Let's see. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. Hey, hey, not three at once. Just, just one at a time. Hey, now, now, apple pie. You're gonna turn into an apple pie. You better quit being ugly. I'm not giving you any. Romeo. <sighs> yeah, if you want some, you gotta be nice. Would you like some? Oh, stay back. Would you like some? Oh, oh, be no oh no. Oh no. That's a no no. No, ma'am. No more for you. All right. So I'm going to walk down here and get the bigger donkeys. And she's not getting any. She's being ugly. Get the bigger donkeys and the llamas. Y'all want some? You want some? Huh? Would y'all like some? All right, let me see if I can use this. Use this. That's not for you. <laughs> Hold it up a little bit more. All right. Hey, honey. Oh, what do you think about that? Oh, right, now we're not spitting. We're sharing. <laughs> nope. Okay, so I don't know about this because honey just spit on me and I'm not getting spit on again. So we just gotta, I don't know. We just have to separate them to feed them, I guess. Socks, would you like some? Now, honey, I'm not coming near you. You're being ugly. Carly says, give me some of what you got. All right, here we go. Here, socks. I think the problem is they really, really like it. I think that's the problem. Look at her go. She is going nuts. No, I'm gonna go back up once honey gets away because honey has spit at me twice and two times is too many. <laughs> honey, I'm not giving you any. You was being ugly. Why y'all got your ears back? All right, what I think I'm going to have to do is pour it in the deal because this ain't working. Badger, you didn't even get any, huh? See, honey, I know you're not meaning to spit on me, but you, you can't have it all. You cannot have it all. Badger. I know, I was trying to get to y'all. 
<laughs> I don't want to spit on again. Here, honey. Honey, come over here. Mm. Mm, let's see if honey will go in there. Good badger. Carly down. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what to think about that, do you? Nope. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pour it all in here and they can share it because they're just, not yet Carly. I'll feed you guys in just a little bit. You already had your morning breakfast. Okay, so that did not go as planned at all. Like I, I thought it was gonna be a lot easier. One with the donkeys, I thought I'd be able to get closer to beautiful cupcake. Then down here, I thought with them being more tame, the llamas being more tame than like the ponies and stuff, I thought they were gonna be the good ones, but it was actually most of the ponies, except Miss um, Apple Pie. She wasn't very nice, but all right. So we're gonna walk in here and see how the other ponies are doing and take them some snacks. Okay, so what I'm doing is I am going this back way and I am going to try to hop this fence without dumping out all the food. But um, I'm going this back way because the ponies are down here and Toby found me, but I'm hoping the dogs don't really like try to bombard me since I do have treats. And so that's what I'm gonna be doing back here. And they're all three back here. I don't know if Milky Way will come up close, but we're gonna get with Stevie and um, uh, Juliet and we are going to get them some feed first and hopefully Milky Way will make her way up to us. So it looks like they're back here. Toby's trying to sneak up on me but if I stay calm maybe he will stay calm. Juliet? Stevie? How are y'all? I feel more safe back here with them than any of the other animals. Stevie, you got a, oh, oh, you got a vine in your hair, stuck in your hair. Hey, Stevie, you want some of this? What do I got? Juliet. You find all kinds of stuff back here. You got a basketball and look here. You want some of this? Look. What is that? Oh yeah, you ate it a lot faster than Romeo. Oh, Milky Way's coming too now. Yeah, I see you girl. Oh, found y'all too. Where'd Dixie go? She was behind me. Oh, <laughs> all three of them. Hey, what do you think? No, Toby, sit. Good girl, Stevie. Milky Way, hi. Oh, that's a good girl. Yeah. Let's go get Stevie. Or right, here, Milky Way, you want some more? Good girl. That's a good girl. 
This is not for you guys. Watch out. Watch out. <laughs> Stevie. You like them good vines? Come here. Oh, you're kind of stuck, aren't you? Let's see if I can help you out. Just don't pull. <sighs> yeah, get out of here. All these vines will hurt you. I know they hurt me. Let's see. Yeah, you're going to have to back out, sis. Here. Yeah, let's get you off here. Of course, I'm wearing shorts this time. There you go. Now you got one more. Oh, it's stuck good. Oh my goodness. All right, can you go? Where are you going? All right, can you can you walk? Huh? Not underneath me. <laughs> All right. What about this? Maybe I can get you to walk for this treat. Not with the vine. I'm not touching that vine. Here. Stevie. Here, Stevie. Look, look. What do you think? Mmm. That's some good stuff. I got vines in my hair now. Come here. Mm. Okay, this is a bad spot to be. Juliet, come here. Juliet, come here. Come. Look, you can get the same thing. You got it wrapped around you now. Uh, Y'all go lay down. Go lay down. Go lay down. I don't want one of us to fall. Oh, you're just gonna push through it, aren't you, girl? <laughs> Might have to get some wire cutters or vine cutters. Right. You want some of that? Oh, yeah. Here, let's see if we have some. All right, don't be forceful. Easy. Easy. Good girl. Alright, you ready? You want some more? I'm st stepping on this vine so if she walks off. Ooh, it might get me. Here's this. Good girls. All right, so bucket kind of got knocked out of my hand, and they're <laughs> y'all pups. Come on, that is not dog food. Yeah, that is not dog food. But um, they're a lot more calmer than the regular animals on the outside. They're still a little bit pushy. I mean, they're, it's treats and I mean, I'm kind of pushy with my treats too. But what I should have done, I'm gonna go grab a little bit more and actually go find Bushwhacker. I bet he would like some of them too. So we're gonna go find him. Okay, so on my way to get some more treats for Bushwhacker, I found the duck swimming in one of the water buckets. What are you doing, Mr. Duck? You getting warmed up or cooled off? One or the other, because it's actually really pretty today, so you don't have to either way. It's just a bath, I guess. Hi, Mr. Duck. Hi there. Would you like some snacks? Look, would you like some snacks? Yeah, you can come get it. Come get it. Don't be scared of it. 
Come get you some snacks. He's so beautiful. There you go. There you go. Look, and I'm going to back away. I'm going to back away a little bit. You know where those snacks are? We actually filled this bucket up. And then it got rainwater and goats and everything inside of it. But we actually filled that one up for Mr. Duck. It's over here, dude. All right. Doesn't seem like you want it. Well, I tried. So now let's go find Bushwhacker. All right, so it looks like Bushwhacker is back over here. He's eating. He loves it, this grass around this pond, which the pond looks pretty mossy and gross. But maybe that's what he lacks. Bushwhacker. I have you a treat. Oh yeah, what's that sound? Look. Come on. Look. Look. You want some of that? Yeah, you've been in the pond and stuff, so that's why you got the flies all over you. Here, let's see if your nose will fit inside of the bucket. Here, look. What's in there? Mmm. Good boy. <laughs> you like that, huh? <laughs> oh, that Stevie found me. Hi. All right, all right, Mr. Walker. All right. There's the rest of it. There's the rest of it. There you go. Can y'all share? Huh? Can y'all share? Be good? He's like, I just care about that grass. All right. Well, that's all the feeding I'm going to do for them. That's just, I don't know. That's, Feeding the animals is more, I guess, for Brandon. I may put up a good front not being scared, but some of these animals, they just, they got some big hooves. And it's a little bit scary. Hey, little Anne. Hey, sister. How are you? How are you doing, huh? Yeah, y'all know it's your turn now, huh? I told y'all to wait, huh? And then you'll get some lovin's. Well, I was just trying to get close to them where y'all not bombarding us. Oh my goodness, you're so big. Look how nasty you are. That was, that was not hurting you, you big old baby. Oh, so sweet. He is doing so sweet. <laughs> All right, I gotta get my bucket. <laughs> that piece of nut. All right, guys, but that's all I'm gonna do for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up, turn notification bell on, and subscribe. God bless.